Hello everybody, my name's Zero Damaru, and welcome back to the Flame in the Flood. So, we had uh, just picked up a little bit more old lumber, uh, killed a wolf to get it, you know, all that old chestnut. And we get on a raft and immediately are rewarded with amazing music. So, you know, all in all, things are going fairly well. I'm actually surprised with how long this, uh, this character has lasted. Um, unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be able to get over to that. Nah, I'm not going to be able to. Alright, again, it's nighttime and there's nothing we need at the stand of trees, so we're just going to go buy it. We have nothing... We have no reason to stop there. Um... Looks like we're heading into an industrial area again, which is actually good because that's what we need right now. Basic supplies, we're fine on. It's the stuff that we need to actually, you know, upgrade the raft and carry on forward that we need. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a shopping cart I missed. That kind of sucks, but what can you do? Staying out of the rapids where I can, especially on a river this narrow. Another sand of trees coming up. I might actually stop at this one since we're in an industrial area. But actually, I'd rather go over to that one there, I think. And of course, it starts raining. Um, which way do we go? We'll go over this one, I guess. Since it's closer, maybe I can get over to there next. Eh, that might actually... This might have actually been a mistake. We'll see. Alright, we're at Pinewood Crop. Alright, it is still nighttime, so let's just make sure we have our tainted bait ready to go. We have some cattails. I don't think I need any more of those. No, I'm fine on cattails. Search the car, though. See what we can find. More raft schematics. Don't really need those. There's a wolf. That wolfie. And then... Alright, so that'll take care of him. The rain is stopping. I'll probably want to go ahead and use this fire uh, to get rid of the wet effect. No reason to let that uh, hinder us. So let's go ahead and light the fire. We'll go over and get that wolf as soon as we are taken care of. Actually, while we have the fire going, we might as well see if there's anything that we can cook. Now, let's go ahead and cook up a couple of ash cakes. Now, we'll cook up all the meat we have since we're about to pick up some more. Hmm. Yeah, see, I'm not really sure what the difference between... You know what? Let's make a cooked meat and then we'll make a jerky. Because I want to compare the two. Like, is there any reason to make one over the other? Oh, pardon me. I imagine there will be... Uh, for all I know... Oh, what's this do? Uh, boiling up various herbs produces a medicinal draft. Or draught. I don't know what that does, though. Uh, tainted bait, tinder, torch. I should maybe make one of these. Um, but for now, I think we're okay. Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna leave that. As is. Now, as I said, I want to go and take a look-see real quick. In my inventory, so we have... Okay, so cooked meat is ultimately better. Because I don't think things, like, rot in this game. Alright, we'll just grab a couple of cattails. And let's do some more ex exploration. Um, not seeing anything of use so far, which is slightly disappointing. Oh, what'd you find, doggy? Or are you just barking? Um, nope, we have a trunk. So hopefully some lumber. Nothing. Damn. Alright, not seeing any more wolves or pigs yet, so that's a good sign. Wild garlic. Eh, we can eat it. Might as well eat what we can and save the meat for when we, you know, either can't stop or don't want to. We're here anyway. There's no reason to pass it up. 
Alright, there's that fire again. Um, I can't remember. Did I search this car? I think I did. Um, let's see. Yeah, no, unfortunately nothing really here. Let's go ahead. Oh yeah, we picked up a raft schematic. Uh, I'll put it on the raft for now, but that's probably going to be one of the first things we ditch if we have to. Alright, so let's chow down on some of this garlic. Uh, how are we doing on the backup reeds, or, uh, cattail supply? We're fine, so we're just actually going to get rid of those, I think. We'll make one into a braided cord and get rid of the other. And then that way we're full up on the braided cords, because those are actually super useful. Discard that. Wolf High can go to the raft. No, it can't. Yeah, honestly, we don't need any more wolf hides right now, so I'm just going to get rid of that. Um, what else do we got? We have some mulberries. I might as well go ahead and eat those up. Clears them out of my inventory, takes care of some hunger and some thirst, which is starting to become a bit of an issue. The alcohol can probably go on the raft. No, it can't. So you know what? We might as well go ahead and make a bandage or two. Because uh, that condenses it down into one item instead of two, and also, you know, bandages are pretty, pretty safe item to stock. You're probably going to need them at some point or another. The one thing we don't actually have, which could become an issue later on, is penicillin. So we should definitely be keeping our eyes out for more of that. But that moldy tuft doesn't really seem to appear unless we actually need to make penicillin, so, you know, that's a bit of a problem. Alright, I want to go this way if I can. So I want to try to hit some of those other areas. Oh, can I hit that one? Yes, I can. Alright, let's see what we can find here. At Mallard Point. Alright, so we've traveled 21.5 miles, which... I, like, I don't know, is that good? Am I doing pretty decent? I feel like I am, but... Like, the people who are actually good at this game are probably like, Pfft, that's nothing. You suck. What are you even doing here, loser? I'd be like, I just I just want to play a game. Why are you being so mean to me? Freaking raft schematics. Holy crap. What's with all the skulls on the car? That's a little weird. Am I going to run into, like, roving raft gangs? I mean, that's slightly less imposing than a freaking pig. Than a, um... Um... Not a freaking pig. A, uh... You know, motorcycle gang. Alright, um, you know what? I'm just gonna freaking kill you. So let's go ahead and we'll build that right here. Alright. Because I want to I wanna explore what the rest is on this island, and you're kind of getting in the way of that. Come on, piggy. Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. Here, pig, 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 pig. Why won't you... Alright, fine. Screw it, we're just going to run around him. Take those. Screw you, pig. Yeah, for some reason he won't come near where I've set up the trap. I don't think he knows what... I don't think he knows what it is. Because I haven't really shown, like, knowledge of that in the past. It's just he doesn't want to go near there for some reason. I don't know, maybe they do know what it is. I don't know. I act like I know what I'm talking about when I'm talking, when I'm, like, playing this game. And I really don't. Um, sleep. Sleep would not be the worst idea in the world. Let's go ahead. Is the pig going to let me sleep? Alright, alright. Yeah, okay. He's gone, dog. He's gone. You're fine. You can stop barking at him now. Make up a bit of tinder. And light up the fire. We'll take a drink and then we'll get some sleep. Alright, because yeah, my fatigue is at like 20. So I need quite a bit of sleep. Um, yeah, we'll just leave it at that for now. Leave the fire and then go right back to the fire to sleep. And we need 
like six hours of sleep or so. Okie dokie. Uh, grabbing a quick bite to eat before we leave would not be the worst idea I've ever had. Let's go ahead and just eat that jerky to get it out of the inventory. Oh, I see a wolf. I see a wolf. Let's, okay, it's time to leave. Time to leave. I have nothing else I need here. And wolves, well, I, well I've kind of learned not to fear them as much. They're still not something I really want to screw around with too much. Okay, would have been nice to hit that third one, but I just, I don't think it's a good idea to try. Um, thankfully, we did sleep through most of the night. Oh, I see a shopping cart. Might as well grab that. Come on, Tinder. Nuts and bolts. We really don't need any more of those. I don't know if this Tinder thing is, like, fairly common, or if this is just something that the game is screwing me over this time around with. Oh, there's another shopping cart. Mulberries. Woohoo. Um, Alright, we're going to aim for that to get us through there. Perfect. There's a bridge if we can manage it. Nope. Oh, no! No, 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 no! Why? 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 God damn it. Uh, all that for freaking Raph Schematic 2. Screw you, game. Screw you. Uh, that would be me hitting the wrong button. Ooh, I see two shopping carts, though, and I'm gonna go for for them. Alcohol and what? Jerky. Alright, we do need to stop somewhere so I can take care of my broken bones. We have deer refuge. Um, now, the main question is, do I want to stop here for any reason other than just to patch myself up real quick? Where is my splint? There it is. Use that. That can go back onto the raft. Let's just go ahead and eat the jerky. Thirst is still kind of becoming an issue. Let's go ahead and we'll... Oh wait, it's raining. Why don't I freaking... Yeah, okay. Um... So we'll just drink all of our water. Use that. Alright, it is dawn. So we could explore here. Yeah, we might find something of use, and we're already here anyway. We might as well. Make sure that our tainted bait is ready to go. Oh shit! All right, let's go. I think I have, actually have a bandage on me. Let's go ahead and use that right away. Um, okay, there's two wolves over there. You know what? I'm just going to... Let's just go. They're right near, next to the entrance, and if they aren't going for the bait, they're going to be right on top of me. It's not worth it. Not for what I could potentially get from a stand of trees. Not to mention, there's another stand of trees right there. Do I want to stop? Eh, yeah. Let's go ahead and see what we can find here. We have Old Town Rise. Because because we're in an industrial area right now, I'm hoping we can maybe find some, you know, industrial type things. Um, unfortunately, I left my meat behind. So before we go anywhere, back over to the raft real quick. And make another bit of tainted meat. just trying to see if there was, like, maybe a difference between the two that would make one better than the other, but it doesn't really seem to be. Alright, I'm not seeing any wolves. I do see a place of uh, light a fire, though, so we can get rid of the wet condition. Which will be good. I just want to do some exploration first. Some cattails. We might as well grab a few of these. Probably grab too many there, but that's okay. We do have a car. Still not seeing anything super dangerous. So I think we're going to be okay. Another jar. Those are starting to become a bit more and more common. Ah, for God's sakes. Alright, let's see. I'm going to try to kill this one. So set this up here. Come on, piggy. 
Come at me, bro. Come on. Come on. You know you want me. Bring it on, pig. Bring it on. <laughs> Sucker. Okie dokie. Let's keep looking around, see what we can find. Uh, looks like killing that pig served no practical purpose. It didn't really get us access to anything we didn't already have access to. So that kind of bites. Oh well, did get some more meat off of them, so can't really complain too much there. Some more boar hide, which I really don't need. So, meh to that. Let's go over to this fire pit. We'll uh, grab some tinder. Uh, grab the charcoal from it. And, okay, there we go. I was about to say, it's like, uh, it said sit rather than light fire, which kind of worries me a little bit. I'm just going to wait next to the fire. Actually, what do we have? We have one cooked meat, one raw meat. I want to save the raw meat just in case. Um, the jar of cattails. We don't really need any more of these, I don't think. Or do we? Yeah, we don't. So let's just get rid of these. Um, and we might as well eat some mulberries and then we'll carry on. Fatigue is starting to get a little low, but I think I can go just a little bit further before I need to worry too much about it. Not to mention, if I am going to stop for the night, I'd rather stop in a place that actually has shelter. Outside next to a campfire isn't too bad, but, you know, better options. Uh, so let's go ahead and just take care of a few things here. That can go into the raft. Seriously, the number of jars we get are getting is a little ridiculous. I'm going to get rid of that. Uh, nuts and bolts that can go into the raft. How are we doing on nuts and bolts anyway? Four. So, eh, don't have as many as I thought, but we definitely have more than we need at the moment. Though once I get this thing repaired, that might not be true. Because that is still something I have to keep in mind, as I did just smash my raft into a rock. Not exactly the brightest move in my career, I won't lie. Alright, carrying on. Hopefully, we can find what we're looking for. There's a... Excellent, penicillin. That's exactly what I wanted. That was the one survival item I was a little nervous that we didn't have any of. Now, as I said, it's all about just raw resources. We're kind of at that stage in a survival game where you're less trying to survive and more just trying to improve your lot in life. But to that end, let's try the rapids. A river like this where it's kind of a fairly, you know, easy and straight... Well, straight shot? Oh, there was a uh, card over there I missed. Um, you know, it's not so bad. Uh, but how am I going to go around this? We're going to go this way... And then there. Alright. I do see a raft upgrade place. Let's go ahead and stop in there, if for no other reason than to get the raft upgraded. Or, uh, repaired, I should say. Oh, that freaking cart. There we go. Sneak through there. Grab that. More alcohol. Goody, goody, goody. Alright. To the raft upgrade place. So the first thing we need to do is get some repairs done. Let's find out how badly the raft is hurt. Ah, only by 20. I could use a piece of old lumber to fix it, but you know what? I'd rather use up the nuts and bolts right now. So one and two. That's 99 out of 100, which I declare is good enough. Uh, is there anything we can make at the moment? Nah, everything needs like three raft framework, three raft framework, two raft framework. Three raft framework, yeah. Nothing we can do right now. We just don't have the wood. I haven't found any freaking wood. Now let's go ahead and stop at that uh, gas station thing over there. The sun is going down, which is slightly worrying, but it's also going to be a place to sleep. I will probably do a full eight hours to fully restore my fatigue and make sure I can do it in a place that's out of the rain. 
We're not going to bother looting this place for now. We're just going to run straight to the door. I can't get in. Uh-oh. Is there any place I can sleep on this island? Like, is there a school bus or something? Go away, wolf. Go away. I just want a place to sleep. If I get too fatigued on this island, that could be bad. Away. Alright, no, this is a bad island for this. Because there's no place to actually sleep. So let's get out of here. Away. On the raft. Alright, so that sucks. It would have been nice to have been able to loot that island, but... I'm so close to being over fatigued right now, I just, I can't, I can't take the risk. Like, falling asleep on the raft is bad, but not nearly as bad as falling asleep next to a hungry wolf. So, you know. Maybe should have stopped to rest when I could. What was it I was just saying, like, a couple of episodes ago? Like, if you think you can go one more, you can't. You know, and you, sh and you shouldn't. And what did I do? Yeah. Never claimed I was able to take my own advice. Oh, there's a shopping cart. It's more nuts and bolts. Not what we need, but not completely and totally unwelcome either. A repair patch. That could actually come in handy. What I really need, though, is a place to freaking sleep. There's a gas station coming up. Maybe we can sleep there. I really, really, really don't want to fall asleep in the freaking rapids. So, you know, let's not do that. Alright. Please let me sleep here. Actually, I wonder if I should just let her collapse at the dock. What are my... Oops, wrong button. What are my... My fatigue's at four. Alright, I'm gonna make a run for it. This might be a mistake. Oh, yeah. No, this was a mistake. I can tell you already that this was a horrible, horrible mistake. Let me in. Oh, no, I can't go in there. Oh, I am so dead. I am 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 dead. Holy shit, snacks. No! Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, this is where we end. No. Ah, oh, frickin' hell's bells. I knew that was gonna be a mistake. I knew it! I knew it and I did it anyway! Why? Why did I do it? I should have just let her collapse at the docks. Ah, oh, well, that ends our first run. I got cocky. That's, that's the only reason that one, that one ended, is I got cocky and thought, you know what? I've been going so far, I am invincible. And invincible I thought I was, and away I went and got myself absolutely murdered by three goddamn wolves when I had four exhaustion. So apparently wolves also do exhaustion damage. That's something I've learned from this run. Uh, a few other things I've learned. Um, don't use lumber unless you absolutely have to uh, because it's very important and very hard to find. Uh, if you find lumber, take it with you. Um, learn the uh, the importance of, uh, you know, sleep management. I, I think throughout this entire run, and so I'm going to do a little bit of a post-mortem run on this one and then, you know, pick up where we left off in the next episode. Um, but I think in this one, I managed all of my resources perfectly fine, with the exception of my fatigue. I think I was far too willing to carry on when I should have stopped and rest, rested, even for a couple of hours. So I think that's something I have to kind of keep an eye to, is, you know, if we stop at a fishing place or a place that has a place I can sleep in relative safety, then I should take advantage of that, rather than just pushing forward until my sleep becomes something where I'm forced to take risks just to make sure that, you know, something bad doesn't happen. Um, you know, it's, it's a risk management game, essentially, at that point. It's, uh, you know, what is... What do you do to make sure that you don't have to take risks in the future? But either way. So that is the end of our first run, uh, at least our first uh, recorded run, successfully recorded run, um, in The Flame and the Flood. And I hope you will join me in the next episode where we pick up with Survivor number two so long. Oh, actually, sorry, guys. I'm not going to so long just yet. I wanna wanted to kind of pull back so you guys could see the uh, the course that we took. So, uh, 21 day survival record, 23 or 24.3 distance record. 
And here is everything that happened. As you can see. We had a little bit of a run-in with a raft there, then down, and down, and down, and down. You know, some more starvation stuff. Not sure, I think the healing is like where we stopped to heal a status condition. You know, picked up a laceration, picked up an infection, healed the infection or something. You know. And down, and down, and down, and down, and down. So that is the course that we've taken over the last few videos. So, now this is the uh, the goodbye part, guys. So, I hope you have enjoyed, and I will see you next time. So long.